More than 215,000 Blue Cross Blue Shield policyholders in North Carolina are in line to get refunds totaling more than $155 million from the insurance carrier. It represents a return of contract reserves that are no longer necessary because of changes caused by federal health care reform. The bad news is individual Blue Cross Blue Shield customers will see their rates rise next year. Depending on the plan, rates are increasing between 2 and 5.4 percent. It's less than the insurance company requested and the smallest increase in four years. In a news release, when it requested the rate increase, Blue Cross Blue Shield said higher rates are needed due to some parts of the new health care reform law. The insurance company said these charges include unlimited lifetime maximums, enhanced preventive care coverage, and no dollar limits for certain types of care. Blue Cross and Blue Shield of North Carolina President and CEO Brad Wilson said the refund is possible because some insurance policies will have a shorter lifespan. Policies purchased or substantially modified after March 23rd of this year, the enactment of health care reform, those policies are going to end in 2014 under the new health care reform law. Wilson was careful to say if you had your policy before President Obama signed the bill on March 23rd and don't make any changes, then you can keep it. He also explained how the health care reform law will change how rates are calculated in North Carolina. The, you, the trend that you will discover is younger and healthier people's premiums tend to move up and older and less healthy people's premiums continue, uh, trend, uh, tend to trend down slightly. Under the health care reform law, rates will be set using a community rating system. Critics of community rating say it encourages healthier young people not to buy insurance because they don't need it and can't afford it. They also say it will ultimately make health insurance more expensive. For CarolinaJournal.tv, I'm Anthony Greco.